So TALL is actually a, a category of patients that is really very difficult to handle because we know that we have limited options. Specifically in the setting of relapsed TALL, this is really a, a setting which is very difficult to treat. We really have very limited treatment options. So uh, because of several preclinical pre data that we had uh, regarding the importance or the, the role for the use of hypomethylating agents, whether in the relapse setting or as maintenance post-transplant, uh, in addition to the uh, data that we're starting to have more and more regarding the use of uh, venetoclax, uh, we've actually been combining uh, venetoclax with uh, hypomethylating agent uh, as a cytidine specifically uh, as post-transplant maintenance uh, for patients with high-risk TLL. So actually, we're presenting in this uh, annual EBMT meeting, uh, we have a poster uh, presenting data from a case series for patients from our center in Lebanon, American University of Beirut Medical Center. Uh, we've sh we're showing excellent uh, results in terms of uh, disease control post uh, allogeneic transplant, bearing in mind that these patients really had high risk disease. They were all at uh, significant risk for relapse post transplant, and uh, most of them are actually MRD positive. And uh, we have a good control of disease, uh, and we have really uh, uh, limited safety concerns. So. Uh, I think the future will tell us if this will be uh, soon a standard of care, hopefully, because this will help uh, improve the outcomes of these patients.